These are just some little paracord flowers. You should find that they're not too difficult to make. To make this flower, I just want to take my paracord and feed out about 70 centimeters. And then I want to take a bite out of it and then a second one and feed that up through the first. Should look like that. Take the end up through that right hand loop, underneath and then up through the left hand loop. And now this is going to form a petal and this one here, this loop here is going to form a petal too. I want to make them around about the same size. Then I want to take my end and throw it down that right hand loop again. And now just work the knot gently together. Don't tighten it all the way yet because we have to form our third petal. I want to make these two loops around about the same size. And then to make the third petal what I want to do is take my end and then go through the center of the knot under these two strands here. This one here and this one here. Just straight up through the center of the knot. Pull that through until it's about the same size as the other loops and then we can finally tighten the whole thing down just by pulling on each of these loops here. And then you'll find that this final loop is still adjustable so we want to lock that into place and how we're going to do that is we're just going to snip this end close to the knot And then we're going to get a crummy old knife, one that you don't mind getting all black and full of plastic. And then we're just going to sear the end and burn it into place. So I just heated up my knife and now all I need to do is just sear that free end. Just gently melt it and massage it. Just so it won't come undone again. And that's pretty much it. That's the flower done.